everybody, it's Heather with Diamonds and Dragonflies, and I am here today with my second um, of this week's Be Frosty Sponsor Showcase. The company that we are going to show today is none other than Bella Art De Nicole slash Bella Art Diamonds. I am also very proud to say that I was selected to be a brand ambassador for Bella Art De Nicole slash Bella Art Diamonds. So thank you, Nicole and Jamie, for having faith in me. Um, I have loved your products. You were the first small shop that I ever found. Nicole was actually my first diamond painting community friend. And I am so happy that a year later, despite the ups and downs that her and I have had, we are both very strong-willed, passionate people. And sometimes they, they clash and they bump heads. But we have always forgiven each other, given each other grace, and I am so happy to be able to call her my friend. And I love her products. Her trays are my favorite. I kit up into them every chance that I can get. And I've decided that uh, 2025 is going to be the year of expanding that. So before I get into this, I want to talk about Be Frosty. So, Be Frosty 2024 starts this Thursday, November 1st. It is a an event that is being held through Bee's Crafty Corner Facebook group. I am co-hosting it with Sabrina, the owner of Bee's Crafty Corner, who makes, in my opinion, the best release papers on the market, but you be a judge yourself. Um, the event is being run through there. I will be doing some pop-up giveaways, both on my Facebook group and here on my YouTube channel. In order to qualify for prizes, you need to obviously be following her Facebook group and be a member because that's where you're going to be putting your posts. But you also need to be subscribed to my YouTube channel. Um, it is free to subscribe. Um, if you do not have a YouTube account, you need to create one. Once again, completely free. And then you can subscribe to my channel. Uh, you will need to show if you win a prize. You will need to take a picture, a screenshot and either send it via email or through Facebook Messenger showing that you are subscribed to my YouTube channel. Obviously, I will know that you are already subscribed to Bee's Crafty Corner. Um, the link for my Facebook and Instagram is down below. I will not be doing anything but just showing updates and promos on my Instagram. Um, feel free to follow me on Instagram if you would like. I'd love to have you. Um, I would suggest that it's not required, but I would suggest that you follow my Facebook group too. There's lots of info there. Um, I share, I do a lot of giveaways, et cetera, and I would love to have you guys. Um, I'm doing a special giveaway. This is just from Diamonds and Dragonflies for Be Frosty. So anyone that posts their start photo no later than 11.59 p.m. Sunday, November 4th at Eastern Standard Time, will get entered into a drawing where I am giving away a Christmas edition of paint gems. So this is a really big one. There are 16 different designs and I will be giving away this paint gem set for anyone that fills out the Google form and submits their start photo no later than 11.59 p.m. Sunday, November 4th. So you have until then to go and fill out and sign. Now I know some of you are doing jiggle drills and that doesn't start till November 15th and you need a new start. That's okay. You can go ahead and just submit your start photo. You don't have to start yet. Um, so when submitting your start photo, keep in mind that if you do a kit that is any holiday, any holiday celebrated throughout the year and or a winter theme, you will get an additional plus one entry into the event. You can do any theme, minimum 30 by 30 or larger. It can be a whip. It does not have to be a new start, but you must have a 30 by 30 section undone that you can do for the event. So those are the parameters. Now, after week one, you can earn an additional plus one if your progress photo is posted showing that you are using release papers from Bee's Crafty Corner. So you can earn up to three entries into our grand prizes. And guys, they are phenomenal. Absolutely phenomenal. So keep that in mind when you are picking out your canvas, setting it up, 
please do not post your start photo with release papers on it. Don't do that. That is for week one. For the first week, we want to see the whole picture so that we know whether or not to give it that plus one or not. All right. But keep in mind that you can, you have up until December 1st to enter. It is a two month event to enter, but start, if you put your start photo up by Sunday and fill out the Google form, then you will go on a drawing to win this amazing paint gem Christmas edition. Okay. All right. Now back to today's sponsor showcase. So I am doing a special one. The next couple of days are going to be um, single shops because I have a lot to show. So this one is Bella and included in here is an, or, um, an order or two that I have made. And then also our Halloween mystery kit that I purchased. So Bella does these seasonal mystery boxes. They did one in the spring, one in the summer, and then they did a Halloween one. I'm really hoping last year she did not only a Christmas deluxe box, but they also did an Advent event, which and a 12 days of Christmas, and I loved it. And I'm really, really hoping that they're doing that again. So I am super excited. This is the Halloween mystery stuff from my mystery box. We're gonna save that for last. And let's go into what I purchased. So this was in, where do I wanna start? Let's start here. So this was an order that I placed. I love how they stack stuff inside each other. But this is a pour spout that was designed to go with the 4.0 trays. I have some 4.0 trays in here, so I will show you how that works in a moment. And then look at this cauldron. They did a special one that they did not repeat for this year, but they did a special one last year for the Halloween mystery box, which I purchased. So when I saw that they were doing these in different colors this year, I had to grab one because these are so stinking cute and I love them for my trash drills. So this one is in a beautiful purple color. And there's one magnet that is made, that is, built into it and then you have the outer ma magnet. I love that because so many times the magnet on this part falls off and I have to have my husband re-glue it. This way that doesn't happen. So look at that adorable little cauldron. It came with a couple of different colors. So there were a few different colors that you could choose from. So this is going to be two of the 4.0 trays. Now, they have decided that they are no longer going to do these 4.0 trays. They are doing 3.2 and 2.2 versions, and I'm super excited. Oh, my God, this is gorgeous. I think this was called Raspberry Golden. That is amazing. Okay, I might have to get a tray tower done in this color because this is stunning. Okay, so... They have added to their design the little uh, shelf in the back to collect your drills. They have eliminated the one on the side here, the line, so that you it's over so you can easily get to it. They have fixed the sizing in their, their lines. They still have the funnel section. So this comes off and magnetizes, but you can use that to put your label on it. But now there's a little lever that you can open to release your drills. And I'm gonna see here, how does this work? Does it go like that? Oh, I think it goes like that. Okay, it goes like that and then you can pour your drills out. Oh, okay, that's really super cool. That works really well. Okay, so it just sits on there and then you can pour your drills out. Very, very cool, okay liking that a lot. Unfortunately, like I said, these will be the only 4.0 trays that I have um, because they have decided to discontinue them, I think, or they're being remade, um, redesigned down the road. But for right now, they are just upgrading the 3.2, the 3.1 and the 2.1 to make 3.2 versions and 2.2. This is the large tray. This is what I'm going to miss. It had notches to lock it into place there, so it was much more secure. This is the grid tray. So this is the large grid tray. 
in the same color. That is so pretty. But unfortunately, a lot of people had difficulty opening and closing the lid, so they've gone back to their old design for that. So they're working on it. They're working on seeing if there's some way they can make the people like us happy, but make it easier for people to open and close. So it's a work in progress, people. So then I have this color, and I'm sorry, I don't remember what this color was, and I should have probably looked that up. But once again, I have a small tray. Oh, this is beautiful. Is this the blue purple stardust star stuff or something like that? Because this is like a a um excuse that that's just a little extra piece of filament on there. And if you guys run into that, I didn't understand why people sent little emery boards and stuff, but this is perfect for if you get a little piece of extra filament or it's rough, like that's a little rough right there. You know, they're 3D printed guys, you can't catch everything. Do you have any idea how many trays they print and put out a week? Almost, I almost have it. Perfect. See, took what, a minute? So there you have that, and then this is a grid tray as well. I love these. The grid trays are my absolute favorite. So we have those two colors. These two colors I think are still available. I don't I don't know if the listing for the 4.0 trays are still up or not. I know the 3.2 ones are not up yet. And then I had to get the new Emma Casey Dragon. So I got a Max tray, but this is a 4.0 version. So it has the removable and the little lever. Oh, this one's like really easy to open. And it is a grid tray. I love that they got rid of all the single placing. They have a full single placer one. But look at that. It's her pumpkin patch dragon artwork that she released with um, Enablers Outpost. So she is signed with many different companies. Uh, Emma is a phenomenal artist. Uh, I think Bella was her first. I might be wrong with that. But Bella has a lot of her artwork and I love it. And I have all of it but one. Luna Kitty. I'm not a cat person. So Luna Kitty did not crawl, claw, oh my God, call out to me. Words are hard, but I love this tray. That is so stinking cute. Okay, love it. All right, guys, and then this I was so anxious for. This is my newest wonder tray. Oh, I love the wonder trays. They are hands down my favorite tray. So, the lid is magnetized on, and then you can also reverse it and put it underneath. Whoops, it might help if I do it the right way. Um, so that you don't lose it. It comes with six removable little containers that have the 2.0 or 2.1 pour spouts in them. So you can use it as one big giant tray, or you can use it as six. You also could do this and use it as five or like that and use it as five. You can also purchase replaceable inserts that are the length of this and they come in a set of three for $10. This does have the pour spout or it has the lever so that you can open it to let stuff out. Yeah, there's a little bit of some string in there. There we go. All gone. There is a funnel, a pour spout that you can purchase separately if you like to have the spout instead. And I never do this right. I never put this on right. There we go. And then you can pour your drills out if you're pouring them into like a bottle or something. That makes it a lot easier. And you might say, well, how does that work with these? 
Well, what you can do is when it's time, you can take these out. And this is what I do. I dump them into here and then I use the pour spout to pour them out. That's what I do. I, but I'm messy and a klutz. This is the Geomagnetic Mauve. I love this color. It is one of my favorite colors because guys, it's purple, just like diamonds and dragonflies. So I love it. Love it, love it, love it. So thank you, thank you, thank you. So I have my wonder tray. I've got all my new trays. I'm so excited for them. Let me get rid of this bubble rack. All right, guys, are we ready? Do we want to look at the mystery box? Yes, yes. Is that a yes? Oh, I think I hear everyone in the free world screaming yes. Okay, so our mystery box. I got the deluxe set, which came with a kit. Now, I am going to give a disclaimer. I am going to unbox this, so you guys are going to get to see this. This was not a kit that was offered to most people, and it is not a kit that was selected for the deluxe box. This would have been for the medium box, but I wanted the other things from the deluxe box. Part of that is because, guys, I own almost all the Halloween paintings <laughs> that, that Bella has. So, Nicole, being the sweet, wonderful person she was, did not want me getting a duplicate kit. So, I had a few options, and she's like, Heather, but that's not the, the one that comes with the deluxe. It's, it's not as big. And I'm like, that's okay. I'm totally fine with it. So, I, I, I did get a little bit of preferential treatment, but that comes from the fact that I own everything. I have so many Bella kits. Um, so... Thank you, Nicole, for being so amazing and for allowing me to be a pain in the ass because um, I am. So she didn't have to, and I told her she didn't have to, but that just goes to show you what she does for her loyal customers. And guys, that whole discussion was long before I became a brand ambassador. So it had nothing to do with me being a brand ambassador. All right, let's see what's in the purple. I'm so excited. Okay. Oh my God. So one of the things the deluxe came with was a resin coffin box. <gasps> okay, that's gorgeous. Look at this box, guys. Oh my God. That is amazing. Okay, that is super cool. Uh, I'm going to have to hide this because the daughter is going to want to steal it. I did buy her a resin coffin um, box last year because they did have them last year, different ones, and she got a purple one. Um, yeah, this one's mine. I'm not, I'm not sharing this year, so I'm going to have to guard that when she comes home because she's going to try to steal it. Here, let me, I was not zoomed in. Let me zoom in. Look at that guy. Isn't I love that I can see through it. That is what is freaking amazing. Oh, I got to figure out what I'm going to put in there. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. Okay. What is behind the orange one? I love how she wrapped these to look like the little hard candies. That is so precious. Uh, I mean, guys, you can say what you want about different people, but the attention to detail that Bella does and making things like this so super cute and taking the time because it is just her and Jamie. They have one other employee um, that helps them physically. And she does all of this herself. And it's, it's amazing. Absolutely amazing. All right. Okay. I got to find where it's taped. There it's... Where it's taped. All right. All right. There we go. Oh, I can't wait to see what else. <gasps> Look at all the stuff. And I guarantee you there's... Oh, my God. That is so stinking cute. Look at that bat. That is absolutely... It's like a ghost bat. So, I do have another four... 4.0 tray. I have this one. And, well, that's not good. 
I can't pull on that. All right, hold on. I'm having difficulties here. I know she had some trouble. <sighs> okay, hang on. Ouch! I found some tweezers, guys. Let's see if... There we go. There we go. All right. God, it was really jammed in there. Oh, my God. That is beautiful. And, uh-oh. Yeah, that's what I was afraid of. I broke this. All right. I'm going to have to message Nicole about that. Because um, it would not open. So. But that is so stinking cute. So, so cute. And then a pink tray. That is so adorable. Oh, it's so, so cute. So, so cute. All right. And then we have this little guy. Oh, my God. He's so cute. So, he has a base. And how they worked this, there's a magnet in there. But you can put, and there's magnets here to hold that onto here. I guess I got to line it up. Where's the magnets? There they are. Maybe I have it backward. Yep, there we go. Um, he has eye holes. You could put your scented wax in there or if you do like those essential oils on the pads, but you could put something in there to make it smell pretty while and use him as a cover minder. So I think that is absolutely adorable and I love it. I love it. All right. Let me put that to the side. We've got our little free package here. Oh, this is so cute. I love all this stuff. This is, and I say free packet. I shouldn't say that because I think some of the pieces of my kit are in here. My, yep. Okay, so come here. Oh my God, that is so cute. It's a pen topper, guys. If you don't multi-place, and you have the opening, the top part of your pen, you can stick this down into the hole and have a little bat with you. That is so cute. And then I got some cover minders. The magnets wanted to get friendly with each other. So give me a second here. I got to pull those apart. All right. So we've got, oh, look at him. It's a little bear. And he's got a little magician wand. And he's got his cape and his top hat. Oh, he's super cute. And then I have this little resin one. Oh, this is so cute. It's got a pumpkin and then it's got these ghosties in the back. That's really cute. We've got some adorable pumpkin stickers. And then we got some sparkle dust. I got 318 and 550 of the Bella sparkle dust. I love the Bella sparkle dust. We've got a straightener. So you can put that in. And then look at my little articulated pumpkin spider. He's so cute. He's got a little pumpkin butt. He got a pumpkin butt. Oh my God, I love it. He is so, so cute. Loving all of the accessories. All right, let me move these out of the way. I'm gonna scoot these. And then let's take a look at my kit. So let's unbox this bad boy. I got Haunted Music. Uh, who is this by again? Lauren LaGuire. Yeah, Lauren LaGuire. She has a whole um, series of these um, ghost paintings. I think there's four, five, four, five, I th four. I think it's four. Um, all Bella kits, they upgrade and give you a Bella essential tray. Comes with your kit. Uh, for anyone who wins a prize from Be Frosty, until they run out, you will be receiving one of these um, as a free gift inside your prize package. I got some butterfly stickers. We're going to put those on my wonder tray. And then I've got a little thank you. And I got this cute little cover minder with the Bella logo on it. I have a whole collection of these in different colors. And I did not have orange, so that's awesome. All right, so we've got a heavy duty plastic cover here, a dust cover. We've got a model number for our kit. So I'm gonna pull this out. Okay, 
Maybe I'm going to pull this out. There we go. All right, let's get rid of that. Soft lint background. I love it. And we've got our drills. We've got a sticker sheet. We've got our toolkit. All right, let me roll this backward. I can do that because it's poured glue to help flatten it out. It will flatten out on its own. Oh my God, guys, look at this. Holy Kalamazoogies. It is adorable. Oh my God, it's so adorable. Okay, so thick plastic cover. We're gonna pull that back to get rid of some of these little crinkles. There's not a whole lot. It also helps flatten the canvas out. Let's do this side. All right. We will come back to the canvas in a few minutes. Let's give it time to flatten out some. I might have to re-roll it. So let's go look at our toolkit. So they already upgrade you to the Bella Essential Tray, which is much nicer than the tray that you get. And I will show you. So we have in here a clear pen with a three-placer brass tip single placer you get a five and seven multi-placers to go with it. You get a random roll of washi. That's cute. This is like, goes so Halloween-ish. And I got Easter uh, washi. But that's really cute. Look at all the decorated eggs. That's super cute. You get a caddy with three blue waxes, I believe. I think it's three. I am having all sorts of malfunctions today, guys. Holy cow. There we go. We've got three pads of blue wax. Please make sure that you peel back the plastic cover before trying to load your pen, but you can store it in the little caddy, and put the lid on it to keep it from drying out. We've got a pink squishy, and then we have stabby tweezers that are very sharp. As you know, I stabbed myself when I was trying to pull some out, but here's the essential tray. Here is the standard boat. First thing you can notice is that the essential tray is taller. The sides are higher, so less chance of drills going flying when you shake your tray. You've got a more tapered and angled pour spout. It has the little ramp. This is raised up so that your drills don't just keep falling out like they do here. Um, the grid lines are much better. They are higher and thicker and better spaced apart. So this is, and this is nice and heavy duty. This is like flimsy. I can like bend this. I can't bend this. So nice upgrade to the, with the tray. So let me stick this stuff back in here. I have upgraded all of my tools. Um, the only things that I use from these uh, is the tweezers and the washi. So let's put that off to the side. All right. Let's look at our drills. Look at these guys. They are beautiful. Okay, cool. This is a square kit. I couldn't remember. Some of them are round of in this, but this one is square. Oh, look at that color palette. That is gorgeous. I don't know. I might actually get to this uh, during Be Frosty because you can do any holiday, any holiday. Here's a big picture of our artwork. Let me zoom in a little bit. Haunting Music, licensed from Lauren LaGuire. It is a 40 by 41 centimeter square drill. There's that model number that was on the dust cover. Where to go for your diamond painting accessories. And then we have, this is 46 colors and it has perforated pre-cut sticker labels that I love. So I don't have to do anything with that. One through eight is one through eight. They do not do nine, so I don't have to worry about figuring out six and nine. Then they do the alphabet, only a little bit of it. A, D, F, H, J, K, M, and Y. They don't want any issues with you getting things mixed up. Then we do have a lowercase e and a lowercase n. Then we have the pie symbol, an anchor, the amber sand, arrow fletching, the uh, wavy um, lines. We've got a diamond, a check mark, a star, 
the nunchucks, three dots in a triangle. We have a corner wedge, a crescent moon, Saturn, X uh, percentage, a female, or is that the male? I can never remember. Male or female sign. I don't remember which one that is. Um, the squiggly, we've got the radiator. We've got three uh, teardrops. We've got the square with the uh, line through it. The at symbol, a fancy little schmancy doodad there. I don't know what that is. Double diamonds together, the omega symbol, the fast forward button, a dollar sign, a music note, and then Nicole's personal favorite, the smiley face. This one comes with three ABs, and then I do believe that 550, yep, and 318, yep. So they added two sparkle dust for me that I can use with this kit. So this is absolutely gorgeous. So let's take a look at our canvas. We've got at the top, share your love for Bella Art Diamonds on social media, hashtag Bella Art Diamonds. We've got their logo. We've got their website. We have one legend going face forward for when you're looking at it this way. When you flip it, then you have one that's facing you again. So they have the reverse legend. Down at the bottom, we have a thumbnail. Haunty Music, licensed from Lauren LaGuire. Bella Art only sells legally licensed artwork. Their model number again, 40 by 41 centimeters or 15.75 by 16.14 inches. Their Bella Art de Nicole logo and then all of their socials, YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok. Most Saturdays at 3.30 Eastern Standard Time, 1.30 Mountain Time, they go live almost every Saturday, so make sure to go and run and join those. And then look at these drills. I'm not going to take these out and take a look at them, but look at these. Look at that AB. I wonder which one that is. Let me see. Oh, that's got to be 823 AB because the other one's a yellow and then a light gray. So these are going to be stunning. Oh, I can't wait. I can't wait. Like I said, who knows? Maybe. So I have a whole bunch of kits from last year that I want to do. So I might save this one and savor it for next year, but I'm not sure. So I will let you know. All right, guys, that's it today for this sponsor showcase from Bella Art Diamonds. I have a referral code. If you have never purchased from Bella Art Diamonds, there is a code down below that you can use to save 10% off your first order. I do earn some reward points that will go into my account that I can use to get up to a $20 coupon code to save $20 on my next order. So, um, but if you've never purchased before, it's a great deal for you. You have to click the link. The link is the code. The link puts the code in with you for purchasing, but it is for first time customers only. Now, I do now, as a Bella Brand Ambassador, have a new code that saves you 5% off and can be used. I have two codes and they can each be used once. The first one is Dragonfly 5 Off Bella. And the second one is Dragonfly 5 Off Bella 2. So two different orders where you can save 5% off. So Bella does not do a whole lot of discounts because they put their stuff as low as possible every day for you. So keep that in mind when purchasing. And guys, thank you so much. Thank you, Bella, for being a sponsor. Um, thank you for being my friend. Thank you for having faith in me from the very beginning. I really do appreciate it. All right, guys, I will see you next time. Make sure you like, go follow, go participate, go join Be Frosty 24 I'll see you in the next one. And remember that without the darkness, we'd never get to see the stars. It'll be okay, guys. I got your back. Love y'all. Bye.